welcome back to my channel today I'm gonna show you this beautiful Gabrielle wig that I got from 20daily.com I know a lot of people have shared this unit on YouTube this is not a review I just wanted to share with you how I wear it because it's a different color it's 4b33 but it's lighter I just wanted to show you how I mix with my dark hair if you want to see how I do that stay tuned Okay, so I have about 10 twists right here, which I did the night before. I use a twisting cream, not really, I don't remember what cream I use, but you can use whatever works for you. So I'm just on twisting those four twists and I have some kind of carrier oil on my fingers so my hair doesn't freeze up. My hair is highly porous, so I have to do that. And that's what the wig looks like. As you can see, I have used it so many times. The wig was much, so much longer when I got it and I had trimmed it a lot of times. Sorry, I did not show you unboxing video. So I just put on the wig right behind my hair, just like that, very simple, anyone can do that. And I use bobby pins to secure. It does come with combs in the front and the back, but I'm not comfortable using any comb because it just makes, it gives me a headache. So I just use the bobby pins in the front and the sides, and that's basically it. And I trim off whatever hair is hanging, um, yeah that needs to be trimmed off and i just do that and that's what it looks like that's the first style that i wear almost all the time it's really simple i really love the wig the curl pattern is really beautiful so the second style i am going to as you can see i'm going to create a, a side part however later on you see in the video that i did not really use a side part that's just to guide me um to help me determine how the style is going to form so I put the wig behind my hair and I just flip up the hair just blend my hair with the wig and it's like sort of like a flipped up afro in the front you know as if you uh, like a comb out afro but with definition I don't know if I make any sense but that's what it looks like and yeah that's the second style and also remember I use bobby pins to secure so my hair sits secure nothing comes off so the third style I'm just sweeping a little bit of hair to the side and I'm securing with bobby pins and that's it really and I use some of my hair to cover where the wig is showing in the front and that's the style, basically that's it. Um, it's just slightly different from the previous one that you saw. And the last that I'm going to show you, I'm going to create a bun in the front. So basically, I create a small section in the front and I loosely twist my hair so the hair, the, the bun will be a little, we have a little bit of volume, you know, my hair is fine. So I had to do that and that's what the bun looks like. So I put on the wig right behind that bun and secure with bobby pins on the side, the back, wherever I need it to be secure. And then I pull some of the hair and use it to cover the bun so that the hair, the wig wraps around the bun completely conceal it so you don't see my hair. I secure that with hairpins actually and that's what it looks like and I just move it forward so that my edges are not showing too much so that's it that's the style number four um, yeah as you can see this wig is beautiful you can get it from 20daily.com it's been around for a while but I just recently got it I mean I got it like six months ago I've been wearing it for six months and it still looks really really good actually that's it 
guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye